All right, and this one we're talking about idle air uh, or idle air clamp. This is a feature that came out with the V3. It wasn't in the V1 and the V2. I see a lot of people using this. They have speed density or they have a GM mass airflow sensor. If you don't have a stock uh, mass airflow sensor, you do not need this section, okay? This is specifically made uh, for stock mass airflow sensor guys. Basically for the conditions where if you're blowing off to atmosphere with your blow off valve, uh, you're running rich in between shifts, um, or you may be stalling. Um, they didn't have that with V1 and V2, and this is basically uh, Tom, Thomas's and Dave's solution to uh, be running, uh, running rich between shifts or when uh, coming to a slow, slow speed uh, stop. So what, what happens is basically when you let off the gas, the air gets vented to atmosphere. The, the mass airflow sensor read the amount of air that's supposed to be coming in, but you just blew that air out of the uh, intake system. The computer doesn't know that, and it's adding fuel to match the air that, it was, that was read. So what happens is when you let push that air out of the system, that extra amount of fuel to match the air is still being delivered. So you run rich between shifts or when you come to a, a slow speed. And so a lot of people have had stalls with that. So basically all you're doing over here, you're enabling your uh, idle air clamp, and then you have two different situations here, AC off or AC on, because you may have a different load on the engine, you may have different situations. But basically, it's pretty self-explanatory. You have your RPMs over here, which one, where you're having the problem at, okay? Then you just either raise or lower these a certain amount. Usually, you may be wanting to lower these. If you're running rich, then you just want to lower them in these areas that you're having the problem to try and prevent it from running rich. The section here is for uh, the coolant-based adjustment as far as fuel delivery depending on what the uh, coolant temperature is at that particular time. So if you're having that problem, you may want to adjust these for that section. Usually you may not have to mess with this. Um, it's rare that, you know, that I see people ever even using this for the reason need be anyway. Um, but if you are needing it, this is for the stock mass airflow sensor guys uh, that are blowing off the atmosphere. It doesn't really apply to anyone else. So pretty self-explanatory. Um, don't really ever use it hardly ever at all. This is one of those tabs that's, you know, basically obsolete to me. I don't ever use it, but it does come in handy from time to time. Uh, this is what you'd be using it for quick and easy. Uh, have any questions, just holler at me.